Yo, what's going on, sexy Samurai Squad? We're back with another kind of spiky hunter. In the sense where we're playing Chernobog. I never play this character because I'm just really, 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 like really bad with him. Um <laughs> yeah, man, I'm not gonna lie to you guys. It's almost funny. It's almost funny how bad with him. Uh, if you're not me, so you know, if you're you, this should be a pretty entertaining video for you guys. Unless I'm so bad and then, you know, you start being like going to the comments. Oh my God, Sam, you could have definitely detonated too and gotten the kill on the Bologna before she altered you. But at the same time, like it's Bologna. I need a little bit of slack coming out of you boys right now because this is a bad matchup. And that's kind of an understatement. It's a horrible matchup even. Oh, but I did land that first auto. Oh, I did land the second. Did land the third. I'm hitting the detonate. Hold on. I'm boxing. Okay. He definitely is completely shitting on me. But, you know, it's just because he has so much HP, so much more HP than me. Like, look at, look at his HP. He's so low, man. He's so low. We're definitely winning right now. Look at that, boys. Look at that early game. Turno Bog coming out to play, having a good old grand old time getting the kills on the Bologna. Well, not kills. I mean, <laughs> not exaggerate. Almost kills. <laughs> we're getting an advantage. We'll say that. We're, we're getting an advantage over the Bologna at the current time. Okay, she did stop my auto attacks for a second, but it doesn't really matter because I already got the red buff and now I'm going for the blue. How are you going to stop me? How are you going to stop me? You can't. Are you dying, minions? Okay. I almost died. That would have been... Honestly... Would have been pretty funny, actually. <laughs> I was going to say it would have been tragic, but it would have been hilarious, right? It would have just spoken volumes about what I was saying earlier about how bad I am with Chernobog, but I didn't die, so we're okay. We lived. We got her blue. We got my red, and it is mine because I'm wearing it. And... Now we're getting my blue, and then after that, I do want to get the XP camp, but... I don't think we can get that yet. We kind of got to sack that in order to get this wave. We traded an extra blue buff for an XP camp, which I will take. Um, I don't have Itch Ball just yet. It isn't either. Cleared. Where is he? Back? Cleared him back? Did clear him back, actually. Surprisingly enough. I'm just gonna put some pressure under tower form here. Well, I would have. Oh, he ulted. Oh, dude, we are so close. I actually would not mind fighting him right now because I do have the shell. The, the small little bait of a shell here. Hammer me, hammer me. Oh no, please! Oh god, we won. Okay. Okay, okay, we got the kill. Shout out to the multi pot. I just want all the comments right now. I want at least a minimum, a minimum of 500 comments that say shout out to multi pot for getting that first blood there. Could have potentially won us the game because him getting ahead of me there, like if he killed me, actually might have lost me the game. So. So me getting that kill is huge. The reason it would have lost me the game is simply because Blona's already a tough matchup for me. And if he's ahead, then it's just no contest. But as you can see, after that kill, we are sitting kind of pretty. The red buff is up again. I do want to grab it. This blue buff comes up soon. I don't mind. I'm actually in a pretty good spot. 
I'm in a pretty good spot. Um. Okay. <laughs> I dashed in. He thought that I was like all in him, I guess, but I just read straight to the wall. He up downed in his ult. <laughs> and just stood there. He stood there because I was I was not dashing towards him. I literally dashed next to him into a wall. And he wasted his ult. <laughs> I mean, lucky for me, really unfortunate for him, if we're honest. He does a Vitra Ball now, though, so he can kind of whoop my ass. He's doing Bull Demon. Are you actually doing Bull Demon? Oh. Um, I, I easily die here if he ults me. He didn't ult me. We are lucky. Oh no, we're not lucky. He ulted the wall. Never mind. For some reason, I thought he had ult back up already, but he didn't. We're, we're chilling, dude. We've gotten every buff in this game so far, by the way. There's been six buffs and we've gotten every single one. The only farm he's got in this game besides minions is one XP camp because I've got all the other XP camps too. We are just completely dominating. We're like, you know that, you know, in Pirates of the Caribbean, that scene where there's like those like people that are like getting hung, but they're not hung yet. And they're all singing that song. You know that scene? I'm like the board that's under. That's me. I'm just, I'm keeping him alive, but like, you still don't want to see me. You know what I mean? <laughs> like, <laughs> that's what I'm doing. I think I die here though, potentially. He has alt and he does have shell, but uh, he decided not to kill me. Thank you. Thank you. Very kind. Very kind of you. Unfortunately. Oh, please, 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 please. Nice. Huge kill. Huge kill. Um, I could definitely hit the tower here, but I don't think I care enough to. So I'm just going to go super, 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 super early game. Uh, Kin Size. And hope that it works. I mean, he, he's going what looks to be a breastplate right now. Again, mid guardian would be better or even like a berserker shield would be really good. Because Berserker Shield is kind of a really overpowered item. And I can't... I don't even have the option to buy that item. So, it's definitely... If he has that option... Or I should say, if you have that option... To purchase a Berserker Shield and your opponent doesn't... And you're both physical characters... 100 million trillion billion percent you should do it. Got the bogeys on my tail. That's mine. Excuse me. Oh, I actually did get them. Oh, oh no, no. Okay. I thought that um I thought that my mannequins would actually kill him, but it didn't. My canes I was gonna say shredded, but actually it only did 126 damage. He's just not very tanky in general right now, I will say. Sorry name, and I was like, huh. Yeah, a lot of people do that. But at least you're still playing. That's super kind of you. At least you don't quit like half the people. Trooper. What a trooper. Go into uh, Kins now. Or not a Kins. I'm sorry. We already have Kins. I want to go into an Xy now. Asi would be really good as well to go into. But I'm thinking... Uh, he's finishing his defense. So that's why I immediately think Xy would be pretty good. Because if I can counter the item he's building before he even builds it... Then he's... And he's still kind of locked in that item. Because... You can't really sell an item like that, or you're in even more trouble than you thought you were. So, it's really nice to build Xe when they're going defense. That being said, I think Aussie might actually be better for me right now. Because I'm hitting so hard because I'm so over-leveled. Like, if I, was, if I was even level, if I was level 10 right now with him, then obviously... Obviously, Xe would be, uh... 
Oh, dude, see, that's a good way of thinking. I love that shit. Good job, go to help. Good job. A lot of people, sorry about my other thought. I'll finish that later. A lot of people, when they fight me, they're like, oh my God, you're literally the best player in the universe. And I'm just going to have six at five because you're you and I'm me. And that's so defeatist. That's such a defeatist attitude. Oh, hello, that scared the shit out of me. I'm going to run away. Um, that's such a defeatist attitude because if we, well, first off, there's a lot of people that I get matched up that are bronze and they are silver because dual doesn't have that big of a player base. So it is somewhat understandable when people quit, but you know, just by the play style, you can tell he's not in bronze or, or silver. So there's no reason to quit because you always have. You know, like everyone's a human. No one's. I'm not better than you, like at person wise. Maybe at the game I am if you're in bronze. Um, but the point is that everyone messes up, and I mess up a lot more than you would think. They don't upload every game. <laughs> that's just that's just facts. You know. Okay, let me put it this way. You know how like fitness youtubers will always they'll only post those pictures if they look really good you know like if the lighting is right and they got a pump and all that shit it's kind of the same way that smite players upload videos unless it, if it makes them look bad they probably don't do it now i will say there are some times when i upload l's where i just get completely dumpstered because i think it's funny and oh my god hold on please don't kill me okay i Wait, he stole it. I didn't even know he got fire. Oh. Anyways, point is. I, there's so many points I'm missing. Hold on. <laughs> the point is. Is that he he earned his rank that he is. And I earned the rank that I am. And if we're fighting. Then obviously the game thinks he's got a chance. You know what I mean? Obviously. So you don't got to give up just because you see my name. I'm not like. First off, I'm not as good as I was way back when in like season two and three when I was number one in the world. I'm not that good anymore. I play a lot more for fun than I do for tryharding now. So because of that, my my skills have gone down and I'm not afraid to say it. Um, So there is a chance that I just straight up mess up and give you a gigantic lead I can't come back from. And also, you could just straight up be better than me. You don't, you don't even know. Like... It really upsets me when people quit before they even want to give it a try because they see my name. I will say, I I I do understand it because like if I'd compare myself to like Conor McGregor, who was incredible as a fighter, and uh, you know now he more so is just a businessman who's worth more than half a billion dollars. Um. If I compare myself to him, basically like a washed up rank one, then I would understand why why people would quit. Because like if if I walked into a ring and I saw Conor McGregor, I'd be like, you know what? I'm gonna leave. I'm done. I'm not. I'm not fighting this. <laughs> so like he's gonna bash my head in, and it's gonna be really bad, and it's not gonna be fun. That being said, if you know, if I got a paycheck for it, he hell yeah, I would. <laughs> that man, that man makes people multi millionaires just for saying their name. But, uh, but no, I can understand where it comes from. I just, I just want you to give it a shot. You know, there's no bodily harm being inflicted. You might as well try. And I mean, <laughs> if there is bodily harm being inflicted, then maybe, maybe you should call someone because that, that is not good. And anyways, back to my other rant about Ossie or Exy. Because I'm so high level and I'm over leveled for the time in the game and way over leveled over him, my damage is going to be higher than normal. And because it's just by default higher than normal because I'm such a high level, Aussie is going to lifesteal more, which makes it worth more, which makes it better than Exe. Pretty simple stuff. Now, I immediately went into Exe after that because I saw that he was going double defense and these two items right here. Um,. But I do still, eat, like even right now, I, I still think that Aussie pick up second was the best play I could have done. 
And I'm happy I did it. Let's see, Fire Giant is spawning. He's coming over here, I think. He is here. He doesn't scare me. Damn, that was a that was a really shitty situation for him. He didn't he didn't clear the fire wave. So if he defends my fire giant that I'm that I'm killing right now, then my minions take his phoenix. And if he doesn't defend it and he clears the wave, then I get fire and I take his phoenix by myself. So that was a pretty shitty situation. I don't think there was anything you could have done to save Phoenix there. Unless you pushed out the wave, got aggressive, backed, and then like stole it with a three or something. That would have been Phenomenal. That would have been insane. Oh, we got the mid guard. Got the mid guard. All right, all right. You have no damage though. So even though you got the mid guard, I really, like, I'm not that scared of you actually. You're super tanky, but all of that tankiness isn't gonna win you the game, unless you have some damage behind it. And you don't just yet. Yo, my damage is nuts. I'm doing some nuts on McGee damage right now. Oh no, don't run. Come back. Okay, just kidding. Run. Ah! Nice. Alright, GG gamer. GG. GG giga gamer. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. There's like three separate rants in it. And also probably one missed train of thought that I that I completely forgot about. I'm sure there was maybe two even. Um, hope you guys enjoyed the video though. If you did, make sure to like, comment, subscribe. And until next time, guys.